The Cabinet takes its meetings around the country once a month uh, and it's important for us to meet in different parts of the country to understand the issues and the perspectives that exist. The Cabinet uh, received its regular update on the economic situation where I was able to give Cabinet information on the continued improvement in the labour market and also the fact that on the uh, GDP statistics about economic growth that were announced this morning, we've seen further positive economic growth within Scotland. Uh, the Cabinet also had an update on the uh, Our Islands Our Future initiative, which has been the subject of intense work between the leaders of the three island authorities, the Western Isles, Orkney and Shetland, with ministers in the Scottish Government led by Derek Mackay, the local government minister. So we've had that opportunity to get that update, to draw together all of that thinking and obviously we'll consider these issues further in subsequent meetings of the Cabinet. And I'm doing a whole host of visits, as are my colleagues, while we're here to understand those questions. But it also gives us a valuable opportunity to discuss the issues around the referendum and wider policy questions with local audiences. And we've had a, a packed hall here in Stornoway Town Hall, um, a very diverse range of questions raised with us by members of the public, and it's been a great opportunity for us to engage in that discussion with members of the public here in the Western Isles.